One of the best ways to improve the overall design of your Shopify store and just level up the experience your customers have when on your store is to use a mega menu. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to set up a Shopify mega menu using the Shopify daunting. And stick around to the end of the video because I put together a special little gift for you that I know you're gonna love. It's gonna help you level up your mega menu even more and it's awesome. So I don't want you to miss out on that. So stay tuned for that and let's get into it. Okay, so for this tutorial, we're on one of my test Shopify stores called AppList Wishlist. If you've seen other videos on the channel, you've definitely seen the store before. Before we get started with this video, let me just tell you a little bit about the process I had to go through just to make this everything work for the video. So when you're dealing with mega menus, you need a lot of products. Now, let me be honest with you, I did not have that many products on this store. I Since this store is for test purposes, I never actually had that many products uploaded. But but I needed products to make the video, right? So I had to manually upload a lot of products. Now, I tried doing this for a couple hours. I got really tired, didn't wanna do it anymore. So I actually ended up making a Shopify app just to automate the process of scraping product images from the internet, randomizing titles, prices, and bulk uploading everything up to my test Shopify store. So I did a lot of work just to set this store up be able to make this video. And you might be thinking, Patrick, did you really need to build a Shopify app just to upload products? Couldn't you have just done a CSV import or couldn't you have just manually uploaded the products? I'm telling you guys, I tried it, didn't work. I got tired. I went back to what I know. I'm a developer. I did what I had to do, but it's okay. Don't judge me. I did it all for you. So you better, you know, like the video and subscribe to the channel. Anyway, let's get into actually setting up the mega menu. Okay, to show you the actual process now, I'm gonna go into my Shopify admin over here and I'm gonna go to online store and you are going to want to use whatever version of Dawn you have installed. I'm gonna use this one because I was messing around with it before for a different video. So you're gonna click customize. Once you get into the customization window, you're gonna head over to where it says header and look for where it says desktop menu type. So if you're using Dawn and you haven't messed around with this before, you're probably gonna automatically be in the dropdown setting and that'll create dropdowns like this, like you've seen these before. But you look where it says right there, mega menu. So it really is as simple as just pressing mega menu and turning it on. Okay, so we press mega menu, we turned it on. I'm gonna make this full screen so we can see this. This is what the Dawn Mega Menu looks like. So you can see there are some links that are bolded in black and there are some that are light in color or a lighter shade of color. Now, what this whole thing means is the different levels of your navigation. So my navigation has three levels to it. So the top level right next to where it says app list wish list is the first level of my navigation. Inside of collections, I have the second level of my navigation, which is denoted by the links that are bolded in black. And then the third level of my navigation are the links that are that lighter color. Now to explain what this actually means, I have to go back to online store and I have to go to navigation. Go to navigation, click on whatever menu that you use as your main menu and look at the way I have it set up. So you see that primary level up top, the first level, and then if I click the arrow to open it up, I see a second level. And then if I click one of the nested arrows, I see a third level. So if you want your, your Mega Menu to look the way that I've had it, or if you have some problems with it, you probably want to go in and update your navigation settings. So it really is as simple as just clicking Mega Menu inside of the header theme settings and just updating your navigation menu. That simple. All right. So that is how you create a mega menu inside of Shopify Dawn. But remember what I said at the beginning of the video, I have a special gift for you if you stuck around for this long and I'm gonna show it off right now. Okay, like I said, the special gift is gonna help you level up your mega menu and make it even more visually impressive. And get this, I got the inspiration for the idea from Kylie Jenner. Hear me out. So on kyliecosmetics.com, a website that I would have never thought Patrick Pierre being of sound mind and body would ever end up on, but hey, here we are, right? So if you look at her menu, she has a cool mega menu. This thing is dope. Like, just look at it. 
So I took inspiration from this and wanted to level up Dawn's native version of the Mega Menu to make it more visually impressive. So to take a look at my store again. I'm inside of one of my development themes and look at where it says desktop menu type. I have Mega Menu as an option. We remember what this looks like. But look at it. I have a new option called Mega Menu Extended. Let's click on it. So you remember what the Mega Menu just looks like. So imagine what it just looked like could go from what it was before to looking something like this. Look at this. Much cooler. All of these images are clickable links that lead to collections. And this big image right here is also a link that leads to a collection. So you could put a little featured product. This is cool. And if you want to get access to it, and believe me, I know you do, because I would want to get access to this too, hit the description of this video, click that link, and get access to it. My gift to you for being an awesome member of the Code That Converts community. So make sure you click that link, get yourself access to the code needed to set up Mega Menu Extended. I got all the instructions in there for you ready to go. All you have to do is click it and get access to it. All right, so that about covers everything I wanted to talk about in this video hopefully you enjoyed hopefully you found it helpful let me know in the comments below what you enjoyed about the video or hey maybe you hated the video let me know about that too either way i'm gonna see y'all in the next one